we made an Archer Queen deck in Clash Mini. So let's give this deck a try and see if you should use it. Let's go! We finally found the game. Took long enough. This is the deck. This is this is actually greater than ah, I gotta play cards. I gotta play cards. Um I we're taking a knee. We're taking a knee. Tim Tebow style. I don't know, is he still popular? Um, they, I wish the time was a little bit longer just because I always get stressed. I never get my minis down in time. I gotta stay focused, knowledge, focus, focus on the game, focus on what's in front of us. Actually, you know what? We actually, okay, no, we got slapped. We got slapped. But that's what you would expect if you still had two elixir. Make sure you play all your elixir step number one. This deck, this Archer Queen deck that you are watching right now is called Hit or Miss. And the reason, it's, it's, I called it Hit or Miss because there was that famous TikTok song where it was like, hit or miss, I guess I never miss, yeah. Um, what do we wanna do here? We need giants, oh, maybe we can get away with just having a guard, actually. Uh, I don't know what to do. Um, I'm gonna, I want giant skeleton. I would love giant skeleton. Can I get a giant skeleton? I'll take a giant skeleton. So I got a plan, I got a plan. I'm a man with a plan. Um, I don't got a plan. I freaking just played cards. So the reason why this deck is called, oh, I hit! It's because of that! Because you hit the target that you're trying to hit, you win the game. But if you miss, you lose the game. So it's a, it's a game inside of a game. Oh my gosh, did we lose the game even though we hit? Oh my gosh, level 10s. Get, get that garbage out of here. Level 10, pff, level 7. That's the new level 10. So last time he played all of his cards in the middle. You know what? I feel, I have a solid suspicion. Oh, are we going to go pro plays here? I think we're gonna go pro plays. Look at this guard in the corner. The reason that guard is in the corner is because if the count is dashes, the first dash or every dash is always to the furthest unit. And right now that furthest unit is the guard. So if the count is dashes, it will, it died before it even dashed. This deck's so OP that it doesn't even need to, it doesn't even need to use the pro plays. If the count is dashed, it would have jumped onto the guard keeping all your other units alive and you want to use your guard as a tank. This is called guard blocking. It's kind of a really big pro tip and it's a way to beat the countess, especially at this high level, especially with this deck. It's pretty much the only reason the guard's in this deck. It's also used just in case you can't get the giant skeleton like we weren't able to at the beginning. Hold up at time. Do you have a mobile phone? Do you want to be a legend? Well, now you can with Mobile Legends Bang Bang. Mobile Legends Bang Bang is a 5v5 MOBA. That means multiplayer online battle arena for those boomers out there. It is a very easy game for anybody to start playing, but if you get good, it becomes epic. Mobile Legends Bang Bang has one of the largest esports in the mobile scene. And from December 6th to the 19th, 16 teams, including North America's own BTK, are competing in the M3 Worlds with a prize pool of $800,000. That's almost a million dollars to see if BTK can bring home the money to North America. BTK just finished their group stages, and to see what happened, you can check out the official Mobile Legends YouTube channel and Facebook channel. To celebrate M3, you can use the M3 pass to unlock Roger's M3 exclusive skin, the Phantom Ranger. And you can upgrade your M3 pass to unlock Roger's M3 Prime skin, the Fiend Haunter. And this is the first Prime skin, and the first skin to have a trial effect. This event will be going on till January 2nd and make sure that you claim your free event rewards like the Emerald Guardian. So if you want to give Mobile Legends a try, there's no better time. The link to download the game is below and make sure that you use my code to get a random skin chest and become a legend. No, 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 e even better. A mobile legend. So he went all left side last time. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna go right down the middle. He's not, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we're gonna do something different. We're gonna try to pick up this miner. We're gonna bowl here. Um, 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 I don't have enough time. I don't know. I, well, I, I got it! If we lose, I'm blaming myself. There's nobody to blame but ourselves. I am. Oh! Spear Goblin! Hit the Magic Archer! Hit a miss! I guess I never miss! Yeah? Uh, we hit, so we win. I'm pretty sure this is how that works. I'm pretty sure this is how the deck works. And it looks like that's gonna be a GG well played, unless. No, there's nothing. Is there any way we can lose this? Oh my gosh, is there a way we can lose this? He was first he was? I think I win. Okay, we're going up against Benny. Hmm. He doesn't really have too many things I'm scared of. He has a miner, so uh, eh. I'm gonna go with the big boom. The big boom's kind of broken. The big boom's really, really broken. I'm gonna put all my units over here, and I'm just gonna throw 
the the guard at the back. The reason the guard is at the back is because when he plays that miner, which is assume is gonna come towards me, the miner comes down, it's gonna go right towards oh that magic archer is getting a little bit too much value. Uh-oh. Archer Queen use your ability. His oh no, he doesn't use the ability because the e -Wiz uses his ability, which removes our ability. We're gonna lose. I forgot how broken e -Wiz is. It will be nerfed soon, I think. I heard it was gonna get nerfed. That's insane. Why didn't we just upgrade our Ewiz? Next game, our only mission is going to be upgrade Ewiz. Um, okay, no, before I forget, I'm actually gonna play my units this time. Count, um, I don't really know what to do here. I'm assuming he's gonna go over there. So just in case, we wanna make sure we hit that mirror tile because that unit will have less HP. He, weird spear goblin, didn't really do much. Uh, Countess, didn't die? You gotta be kidding me. No. Use your ability, or Ewiz! I'm pretty sure we're playing in a match where every single player is a countess. Oh my gosh, this is terrifying. Um, um, I don't know what to do. No, I should have used the clash ability for the guard. Make sure you tap so you can use the last ability because the last ability is so much better. And this wouldn't happen. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Use your ability, Archer Queen, please. Ewiz, use your ability. Kill everybody, please. No. Always the Ewiz. It's... Mm! Oh, why did I not upgrade my Ewiz? We had one mission I chose and I accepted it. Ah. Oh. Oh, this time I'm focused. No more messing around. I am going to win this. Ooh, is it better to let the Countess jump on the Archer Queen or the Ewiz? I think it's going to be Archer Queen. My Archer Queen has more health than my Ewiz. And already, we're on our way to the mission. And we already accepted the mission. And that mission is just upgrade our Ewiz. I'm going to see if that actually is that ridiculous. Because I know Ewiz is probably the best card right now. And oh, yep, there it is. Ewiz. I don't know if my Ewiz did that was anything crazy. But we're going to see what happens. Because I think right now, if we rewatched. If someone from the future, it could be a month, a year, 10 years, a thousand years from now, watches this video and watches what this Ewiz will do in this video, they will probably realize, wow, Ewiz is kind of broken. It might be the most broken card in Clash Mini history, just because it is that, ooh, this is going to be great. This is exactly what we wanted, actually. This is the perfect, perfect, perfect situation. You know what? Oh, I don't have enough time. I don't think my fingers can move. I was going to go to the opposite side, but you know what? Stay true. Mind games. They think I'm going to move because I stayed, but actually, look at that. Wait, no. I, I should have moved because then my bowler would have got value. Um, he didn't really do anything. So you see how the guard took the damage there. After it looked like... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Why am I scared? Ewiz does stuff. No, we should be fine. We have three units alive. Ewiz alive. Still kind of scary, but we got this. Where the heck are the Ewiz? All right, Ewiz. Oh, I'm, I'm, I feel like this is too risky now. I would rather, I think, save it. Maybe I could use it so there'll be a better chance of getting the Ewiz in the future. I'm gonna just do this and, and this and you know what, just this. Because now we use three of our minis. In your deck, you have, for the amount of stars you have, that's how many minis. So right now, we have a three-star guard, so that means we have four minis in the deck. Now, we only have one additional mini in the deck. One additional guard in the deck, so that means we have a better chance of potentially getting the Ewiz. And we're close. We just need... I wish I had a three-star Ewiz. If we had a three-star Ewiz, we would we would win. <laughs> my guard's been back there for so long. Oh my gosh, my guard actually isn't really going to do... Oh my... Uh, did we lose? We lost the last place guy. Oh my gosh. Ewiz, use your ability. Why is the archer not really doing anything? Why was the archer... I thought the archer supposed to hit the furthest away unit. Is it because the guard was earlier the furthest away unit? So she was targeting the guard? Ooh, that's another pro play. Guard not only blocks the archer, or blocks the countess, but also gets targeted by the archer, which is two really good things to note. Here, I'm going to swap, but also here... Oh, I do have a three-star Ewiz! I forgot. That's that's a new thing. That's a new thing. Um, let's re-roll. Ewiz. There it is. Ewiz there. Let's get rid of you. I don't care. We need Ewiz. Ewiz? Oh my gosh, we got it. Holy smokes, we got it. I kind of need... I kind of need the guards, though. Uh-oh. You know what? Stay true. If, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. We haven't lost in this spot, so I'm staying true. Not only that, but we got the Ewiz. Oh, and we hit. We hit. That's part of the deck. Hit or miss. I guess I never miss. Huh? Ewiz. Oh my gosh, everybody's dead. Not only that, but nobody has abilities. Everybody's stunned. We won. Ewiz, four star, and I think you just win. I think. We haven't won it yet. Do we stay? Is that the biggest brain play? Do you know what we're going to do? I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do, actually. I haven't thought this far through. Um, let's go Spear Goblin here, and then I want Double Guard. Oh, I can't get Double Guard, so I'm going to go with this. Um, I don't know what to do. I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay true. I'm going to stay true! 
If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Stay true. Oh my gosh, Spear Goblin's gonna do nothing. It's gonna take off the bowler. So we're already right now in a lead. We have a lead. Bomb's gonna go off. Doesn't really get anything. E was used his ability and we already won. We already won. Nobody can move. Nobody. We won. Mm. This video was about the Archer Queen best deck. This might be just showcasing how good the Electro Wizard is. Can we try that one more time? Just get a max e -wiz and see if we can get a free win. Oh, no. That's such a tease. First round, we get two e -wizzes. Which one do we choose? Which one do we choose? I'm going to just, I'm just going to do this. I'm going to go with you and you and you and you and swap you last second. I swapped you. That's, that's illegal. That's illegal. I don't know what just happened. Oh, the mirror, the mirror uh, giant skeletons are kind of insane. Uh, this could be a problem. Uh, actually, no. Guard is going to be able to take out both. Countess is going to dash on top of the guard. Oh my gosh, we won against the level 10 Countess. I don't want to jump to conclusions, but if we can get to another three-star E-Wiz and we win this all in dominant fashion, I, I think we broke Clash Mini. I, oh, here we go. Here we go. I like doing the Zap 4 first. I, I do like that one. That one's a very, very good one. Here, I think we should save our rerolls. I know it seems bad. You know what? I don't think this person's real. I, I, I think, oh no, Cal 8. Why would they make a bot named Cal 8? He's going to go bowler right in that spot. Uh-oh. Yeah, we lost. Yeah, we lost. Yeah, there's no way we can win this. Yeah, there's no way. Yeah, bomb goes off. E-Wiz. Can E-Wiz friggin' 1v4? No, there's no shot. I want that E was so bad. Oh, I feel so greedy. It feels so greedy. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. E was do BOP. Oh! There's. Oh, why are we doing this? 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 I. Well, this is a good test. It's literally six, seven because he mirrored. Oh, he mirrored the miner too. Oh no. Oh, this is not gonna be enough. It's not gonna be enough. There's just too many units. E was is great. I think we got a little carried away with E-Wiz. I, I, it felt bad leaving it the way it was. I, I didn't like that we left it on such a humiliating loss. Um, I actually have to go bowling in like five minutes. So I quickly, oh, I got to play stuff. I always do this. I always do this. Why do I talk before? Uh, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. That looks good. Hopefully this works. It's a guy, that's against a guy named Nubus. How good can Nubus be? Uh, off to a good start. It looks like the Countess will jump onto the Archer Queen. Archer Queen does use her ability. Archer, the Countess jumps on top of the guard, which is huge, and that should be enough to win this game. Boom, one round. I'm not a big fan of Duel. Duel, I only play once I have a streak going, once I usually get from Rumble. Um, but it is quicker to queue up. The, the queue times, especially where I am, are a little long. And here, I would love to use your. I would love nothing more than to use you, the beautiful, the amazing, the the splendid E-Wiz. But I think right now, I think we have to learn from our mistakes. And I think doing this is the best thing that we can do. Units. Early on, playing more units is always better. And right now, the Countess, boom, that's already a good start. We hit our target. The Countess is going to get the jump. Dash, jump on top of the guard. Ability goes off. Right now, the Archer is targeting our guard, which I think is good for us. Because it's not targeting any of our range units. It's not targeting anything of use. Our guard is just, I feel bad for him. He's just kind of like a shield. But you know what? Isn't that his job? He is a guard. He's guarding us. So, you know, yeah, I'm going to say that, that he's doing well. He's doing his job. And he's doing it well. Now, let's just steal the win. Let's just steal it. He's not going to expect this. He's not going to expect this at all. We are going to swap sides. I know. Crazy. Oh, my gosh. I'm not going to get it in time. Uh, 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 uh oh. I shouldn't have done that. I think... I made a mistake. Oh, we got the hit or miss on the uh, double on the Countess. Countess is out of commission. That's your best unit. We're going to win. There's no way. Oh, my God. Wait, how'd the guard get out of his spot? Why'd the guard... You had one job, guard, and you were supposed to stay in the corner, but we also slapped him. Ewa's three-star is really, really good. This deck... Hit or miss. I guess I never miss. Huh? <laughs> This deck is a lot of fun, and I definitely recommend giving it a try. And if you enjoyed this video, feel free to check out this video over here. It's my newest video. I'll see you guys in that video. Subscribe! Deuces. Bom, bom, dee, dum, bom, 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 b